<laughs> well, speaking of shampooing, Mackenzie Roth is out there giving us some tips on how to camp from uh, setting up a tent to cooking delicious s'mores. Mm. Hey, Mackenzie. Yes, tis the season. A lot of people be camping this Memorial Day weekend. There she is. And if you don't know what you're doing, like myself, you need some help. And Eric Metz joins us now. He here at Shampooey State Park. He's in charge of the experience. Uh, so tell us about, it's kind of like camping 101. If you want to get out in nature, but you don't know where to start. So tell us about the program, Let's Go Camping. Exactly, that's right. So this is a, a learn to camp program. Um, we have all of the gear and, and the, the helping hands uh, to, to get you started and, and coming out to state parks and, and learn to camp. Okay, let's start with the basics. Obviously, you need shelter. So yeah. tell us about the tent, step yeah. one. So tent uh, might be the, the hardest part sometimes getting those set up. We've got a team of volunteers and a trailer full of tents nice. and sleeping bags and sleeping pads. We provide all of the gear for the program, everything you need. You make it incredibly yeah. easy. Okay, step two, food. Now I know we food, have a setup yeah. over here, Eric. Take me, uh, show me the proper setup. What you got so over we, here? We've got a camp stove. Um, we've got coolers. We've got pots and pans, a percolator for the coffee in the morning. Um, of course, we have s'mores yes. and, and other tools for cooking on the fire. Um, everything you need to, to cook and, and stay full throughout the weekend. What do campers need to bring as far as food? What are good foods to bring and ones to avoid? Um, you know what? Anything you can cook at home, and this is one of the biggest questions we get in the program, anything you cook at home, you can cook out in camp. If really? You want, yeah, if you want to make pizza, you can make pizza. Um, you can, possibilities are endless, yeah. Okay, possibilities, things that you need to know how to start a fire, I'm assuming. Fire is a big one. Um, and, and even more importantly <laughs> than, than starting the fire is, is how to put that out. Um, fire safety is big here in Oregon. Uh, you wouldn't want to start a, a forest fire. So we, we teach both how to start it and how to put it out. Could you yeah. tell us really quick, how what is the proper process? Uh, to, to put out a fire? Or to start one and put uh, it out. To start one is a little more complicated than putting it out. Okay. Um, it takes a little bit of practice, but some newspaper, some kindling, some, some small sticks, um, and then of course all the way up to the, the big log. Putting it out, um, always have lots of water, which luckily in Oregon State Parks, there's always a, a water spigot nearby, so that should never be an issue. Have a bucket, um, a shovel is always helpful too. Yeah. Very helpful. Now, if people are like, hey, I wanna go camping, is it too late? Do you need to reserve your beautiful space by it, now? It's not too late, but spots are filling up quickly, yeah. Okay. Um, and if they are interested, they can go to OregonStateParks.org. Um, under the things to do tab and they can find more information. Now I'm always aware of animals and bears and things. Any tips to avoid what should we do? Not leave food open I'm assuming? Not leave food open. Okay. Always store things in a hard cooler um, possibly in your car if that's a possibility. Um, obviously no eating in the tent. You wouldn't want to squirrel or raccoon or oh. or a bear <laughs> or anything in your tent at night um yeah just putting things away at the end of the, the night very important yep. well you mentioned s'mores mm -hmm. could you give us the secret to a perfect s'more coming up later in the show we want to hang out for a um, bit um i think the key is perfect golden okay. brown yeah okay. you can't can't burn it okay we're gonna work on that <laughs> okay. and learn much more camping 101 you guys i'll get the secret for us <laughs> all right Mackenzie, such a nice spot out there a lot of folks thinking camping memorial day also